What's poppin'? Smello back at you with another video. And today, Sep from Unisys sent your boy some samples. He sent you some magic. The Beatmaker Blueprint Pack. That's right. The Beatmaker Blueprint Pack from Unison is completely finished. He shot it over. So what we're going to get into, they have over 9,000. 9,000. It's over 9,000. They, they have over 9,000 samples, loops, midis when it comes to the drum loops and the melodic loops they have not only just the loops they have their track outs for all the loops and stuff like that but also they have the midi for all those loops but then on top of that they have a bunch of one shots they got melodic one shots bass one shots all types of one shots for all the types of drum snares rims kicks all that stuff so it's a really great pack the link is in the top of the description if it's something that you want to check out but first before we get into it be sure to like the video and let's go. So like I told you, they got a lot of stuff in here. The first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna take a quick look at some of the samples. Man, they got some fire in there. They got some straight fire. So this is what we about to do. I got this loop that I like. That's what we're using. I'm gonna make something like kind of a drill beat. Now with that one, I'm going to take the individual track outs and lay them all out so I can use the bass. I'm gonna have the bass hitting it the first part and then after the hook is over, I'm gonna have the drums and the 808 and all that stuff kick in. gonna highlight that let's get to cooking so now this is what we're gonna do they have drum loops but they also have midis with the drum loops i'm gonna go to the drill folder go to the combination loops listen to the audio and whichever one i like i'm gonna put that over this beat Whew. yeah yeah i like that i like that so we're gonna use Gotti. We won't use the loop, we'll use the MIDI. So I've laid out all the drum MIDI. Let's put the 808 in there. And one thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go back to the Latin folder, go to a different pattern and put down the bass MIDI so that when it's time to do the 808, I can match the bass notes. But right now, I'm gonna fill out these drum sounds. Now the great thing about this drum kit, it has an insane amount of drums. We're gonna start with the kick. gonna get a rim gonna go to the hi-hats i'm gonna get three chippy hi-hats instant bounce we have this 808 pattern right here i'm gonna take this go to pattern two paste it right back where it was and down here, we got the bass notes from the actual bass line in the loop. So I'll match those when the time comes. But for now, I want to select an 808 sample.
that one there sounds very drilly so i'm gonna put that right there all right so i'm gonna add a few things like this i'm gonna add this little piece of percussion in there got this percussion i'm gonna add in wasn't hard to make you get you got something hard that wasn't hard to make unison made it real easy for me to make this banger well, let's do another one so i got this sample right here it's one of the pop samples i really like it so this is what we're going to do this time around i'm going to take the midi stems i'm going to take the vocal because they don't have the midi stems for the vocal now they also have some melodic shots in here I'm going to figure out something to put over the roads. That's the first thing. I like that, but not for the main one. I'm going to make that the secondary. I like that. I'm going to put that over the roads. I'm going to take this one shot, layer it over that. Gonna put those on two different channels, do a few things. Boy, that fruity convolver is good. Change the key of this. put some effects on the keys so we got something smooth now let's take one of these bass shots We're gonna use that for the midi bass line that was already there Get to these drums. We're gonna go to hat loop. I think that's gonna be good. That's a good hi hat line. I like shooter. seeing as an accent snare now let's do the same thing we did with the last one put an impact right there symbol at the beginning let's do that right there i think we got a slapper let's play it
Fan yourself. It's, it's, it's kind of hot in here. Oh my God. Oh my God. I mean, you seen it, you made two slappers and guess what? This was very easy, man. It wasn't hard. This gives you a lot of tools to make your workflow a lot simpler. That's what it is. So be sure to check it out. I'll be back with more videos soon. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to subscribe and click the bell to get notified. But other than that, I'll see y'all another day. Somehow, some way, I'm out.